So this is our second story. It's an old favourite from when my little girls were younger. It's called No Matter What and it's by Debbie Gliori. I think that's how you say her name. Apologies, Debbie, if that's wrong. So it's a really sweet little book. Um, so I'll uh, read it and we can have a wee chat at the end. And while, you know, if you're watching this and you're thinking to yourself, I really wish you would just hold the book up so I don't need to look at my face, feel free to let me know and we can adapt it. Um, I think I can hold it like this or, you know, we can figure out a way to make it easier if you can't see the page. Okay. Small was feeling grim and dark. Hmm. Hey, Max. Playing toss and fling and squash. Yell and scream and bang and crash. Break and snap and bash and batter. Good grief, said Large. Whatever is the matter? And there's Small hiding under his tin, feeling very dark. Small said, I'm a grim and grumpy little small and nobody loves me at all. Oh, small, said large, grumpy or not, I'll always love you, no matter what. Small said, if I was a, a grizzly bear, would you still love me? Would you care? Of course, said Large. Bear or not, I'll always love you, no matter what. Small said, But if I turned into a, into a bug, yeah, would you still love me and give me a hug? <laughs> of course, said Large. Bug or not. I'll always love you, no matter what. No matter what, said Small and smiled. What if I was a crocodile? Snap, snap, snap. Large said, I'd hug you close and tight and tuck you up in bed each night. Does love wear out, said Small. Does it break or bend? Can you fix it, stick it? Does it mend? Oh, help, said Large. I'm not that clever. I just know I love you forever. Small said, But what about when you're dead and gone? Would you love me then? Does love go on? Large held small snug as they looked out at the night, at the moon in the dark and the stars shining bright. Small, look at the stars, how they shine and glow. But some of those stars died a long time ago. Still they shine in the evening skies, Love like starlight never dies. And that was the story of Large and Small. And no matter what. Again, I think that's a lovely wee book for this time. Obviously, hope that anybody watching this has not had anybody in their family that's ill. I hope everybody's been managing to get by but sometimes just having a book that you can read to your children and um, use it to discuss those questions encourage them to ask the questions when they're feeling a wee bit rubbish um, or they're feeling a wee bit grumpy it's important that we remind them that we all love them no matter what all right goodbye